The perfect season continues. Ernie Kent, Darren Sutton, the building of championships. McHale, that's right, 105-59, the most dangerous team. Which is dangerous, Ernie, in sharing the basketball, and more importantly, sharing it with the big fellows within. Let's start with Christian Coloco, who is coming of age this year. When you have a player that can pick and then roll, and you can throw above the rim where nobody can get up to the ball, what a luxury if you are a guard, point guard, that can get those extra assists, because he's so explosive. And I just like the fact that they pound that ball inside. They force you to foul them inside, because they're so big, so physical, and they run the floor so well to finish. So this team has all the pieces, all the makings, and then the perimeter came. We just talked about the inside. They now can go inside, outside with the best of them. Shooters understand how to shot fake when teams try to run off the three-point line. You go shooter opposite your post, feed your bigs, force a double team, come back, knock down the three, and guys that can just flat out make the extra pass and knock down buckets. Pretty impressive basketball team. They were six of nine from distance in the second half. And this is what they did really in the first half. They owned the paint. He, here's a little nugget for you, by the way. They had 31 field goals made. They had 31 assists of those 38 field goals. That's a coach's dream, particularly in this day and age, when you're bringing kids through that portal where they want to transfer and you got so many different faces, everybody wants to get there. So this team already has gelled together to share the ball. When you're leading the country on assists, that says a lot about your team. And not only that, you're playing great competition, too. December 2nd. I jumped the gun because they're not going to jump the gun. It's the opener. It's Washington, December 2nd. Pac-12 opener. They're ready for it. And Ernie Kent and Darren Sutton enjoyed talking about this team tonight.